Hola, ¿cómo estás? Me llamo Señor Shepard y hoy vamos a hablar de la fecha. Hey, I'm Mr. Shepard. Today we're going to talk about the date and asking what day is today and answering, hey, today is a certain day of the week. So I'm going to share my screen with you so that you can... Um, see what I'm seeing and now you should be able to see where it starts talking about KDS oi what day is today that is literally what that means K means what D is day S is is and oi is today and to answer you say oi S and then you give the day of the week in this case, I'm recording this on a Monday, so hoy es lunes. So I have the days of the week down here for you. So let's go over those together. Lunes, starting on Monday. Martes, miércoles, jueves, viernes, sábado, and domingo. Those are Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Now, remember, the days of the week are not capitalized in Spanish, and the months of the year aren't capitalized in Spanish. So, practice these yourself out loud. K D S hoy. Hoy es, and then the correct day of the week. For giving the date, the question is, ¿Cuál es la fecha de hoy? Once again, ¿Cuál es la fecha de hoy? That means, what is today's date? To answer that, we use the expression, hoy es, today is, el, which is the in Spanish, el. Then we put our number, today is, catorce. Then we put day, which means of, and then the month that we are in. And currently, it's the 14th of September. So, hoy es el 14 de septiembre. I have the day, the number, I'm sorry, and the month underlined to show you that that's the only part of giving the date that changes. So, anytime you write out the date, the only thing that changes is the number and the month. And notice, once again, the month is not capitalized in Spanish. So, let me go the, over those again with you. The months of the year, beginning with January, Enero, February, Febrero, Marzo, Abril, Mayo, Junio, Julio, Agosto, Septiembre, Octubre, Noviembre, y Diciembre. Practice those on your own. Spanish is a written and spoken language, so we're going to try to get you to learn both of those today. Now, how many days do you have to know to give the date? Well, there's up to 31 days in a month. So I have those numbers written right here, all from 1 to 31. So we have uno, starting over on the left and going down. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez, once, doce, trece, catorce, quince, up to sixteen right here, dieciséis, diecisiete, dieciocho, diecinueve, veinte, veintidós, notice, the E changes to an I when you go to between 20, and I left out a number. There should be 21 right here, 21. That's 21. Then 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, y 31, 
all the way to 31. Some months have 31. Note, there are some that have accent marks on them, such as 22. There's an O over the on the dos. There's an E on the tres, an accent on the E, and there's an accent on the E on 26. That means you put more, more pronunciation on that part of the word, more emphasis on that part of the word. Now, moving back up, I remember one other thing I left off. What about if I want to know what, what day it is tomorrow? What day is it tomorrow? I can say, que dia es mañana. What day is tomorrow? To answer that, I simply turn it around once again. Manana S Martes in this case. Tomorrow is Tuesday. Tomorrow is Tuesday. Hopefully, this has helped you to understand when how to answer the questions, what day is today, what day is tomorrow. Um, also, how to ask and answer, what is today's date. You always answer with hoy es el, then change the number, then the, the month of the year. So, with that, I'm going to say, say that there will be some practice to do over this, and... Make sure you study it and make sure you say those to so, say those to yourself. And if you do those things, then you will know how to ask and answer about the days of the weeks and the date in Spanish and the months of the year. So with that, I'm going to say adios. <laughs>